Well, 47 years of teaching is a, uh, a major part of anyone's life. Do you have any regrets? I do not. If I only wish I was many years younger and had the knowledge that I have today so that I could meet the challenge of the present day. Of course, it's always a challenge. We think that the challenge is greater now than it's ever been, but every generation has had a challenge. I remember when I came to Miami, it was a small town, and we went through the boom days, and with the great number of people coming in that uh, from all over the country, and our schools, we didn't know from one day to the next how many we would have, and we met every challenge. Sometimes the money was short, mm. but you always sort of rise to the occasion. Why are you retiring after 47 years? Well, I think that I'd better retire while I'm ahead. She has always help, helped us. And, well, like in the game, she's, she's always told us not to be nervous and all. And she said even if you lose, to be good sportsmen and never uh, give up the game if you're losing. Well, when I think of Miss Hatfield, I think she's the nicest person I've ever met. Why? Well, uh, when you do something wrong, she'll straighten you out. Well, I think she's very nice, and she helped, she helped me solve my problem when I had one, and I came to talk to her. Uh, she, she always has a happy face on when she goes around the school, and she always says hello to you, and she's, she's very nice when she meets you. Well, Mrs. Hatfield had been at our school for a short time as principal, and five boys, including myself, were outside of her window at this particular noon hour. And uh, since we had a new principal and uh, since we uh, hadn't had any contact with her, we were rather feeling our oats. Well, when the first bell rang, we didn't remain motionless, and we continued to shout and play. And Mrs. Hatfield promptly called us into her office, uh, where she lined all five of us up and gave us a real good spanking. Uh, I never will forget that spanking. It was the first one I ever had from a school teacher, however, not the last, uh, but it was certainly the most effective. Uh, she laid that hickory paddle on very well indeed. 